Hi guys, I'm Gary Hebner, and this is MIDI Explained and Explored in Studio One. So before getting in and creating some MIDI tracks, I first want to set up my MIDI controller keyboard. I've got this Samsung Carbon 49 key that I want to add to my MIDI devices, so let me show you where this is done. To add this, I need to go to the Studio One menu, and then to the Preferences, and then navigate to the External Devices tab. This is my default launch key device over here, but I've just disconnected this so I can show you how to add a new instrument. So I'm going to click on the Add button. On the left pane over here are some already built presets for some popular controllers. So for example, if I've got an M Audio Axiom Pro, I can choose to select this and it'll map it to all the controllers and drum pads on the device. But my Samsung isn't under the list over here, so I'm going to add a generic new keyboard. I'll click on New Keyboard and I can give the device a name. So I'll call this Samsung Carbon 49. I want to use all the MIDI channels on the device. And under the Receive From option, I can choose my device here that's picked up by my computer. And I can also choose this to be my default instrument input, but I'm going to leave this unticked for now. There it is, added over here, that's perfect. So I'm going to click OK to retain the changes. Now let's add a track to see if it picks up this MIDI controller keyboard. So I'll go up here to the track menu and choose add tracks. So this is going to be an instrument track and I'm just going to simply call it MIDI. Now under the input section over here, this is where I can choose my keyboard device. So here is my Samsung Carbon 49 key and down over here, I can choose to add an instrument to this instrument track. What should I go for? Let me go for the Mata synth. I'll click OK and it adds the instrument track over here. You can see it's record armed and the input monitor is enabled. Plus, it's going to the Mata synth and my Samsung Carbon 49 key is the MIDI input. So if I now play on my MIDI keyboard, it's sending the notes from the MIDI keyboard to the synth. Cool, so that's picking up my keyboard. So that's how to add a MIDI keyboard to the external devices menu. Next, let's take a look at how to get the instruments and audio content that comes bundled with Studio One.